What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, welcome back to the channel. So over the past couple of days now, more and more people are talking about the OK symbol being removed from Call of Duty video games, which has given some mixed reviews by the player base, but a huge majority of people have never once associated that OK symbol with something racist. Like that gesture for years has literally had different meanings. The most popular was with divers, underwater divers, using that symbol all the time just underwater to communicate with but then over time it appears that it has developed into something to showcase some type of racist symbol along with the Pepe the Frog meme apparently but honestly guys it, if you can explain to me down below in the comments why those two are apparently something racist I really like to understand like I'm not trying to disprove anything I, I truly am not I just don't see the correlation between racism and those symbols or memes I really don't apparently 4chan has created that um, meaning from what I've researched but then people are saying that that in itself is, is a troll but um, Call of Duty does seem to be taking this very very seriously because they have removed all of the okay hand gestures in their video games except the one and only Call of Duty Infinite Warfare it was removed from World War 2 and it was replaced with a thumbs up gesture and most recently with Call of Duty Modern Warfare it was just removed entirely so um, it's kind of confusing to me because because to be honest, I, I'm with one of those people as well. I don't see how that symbol is entirely racist. Um, but the big issue that I have is they really do pay attention to stuff like that when there are thousands, and I mean thousands of people who've had their accounts banned over the past couple of weeks now, some even dating back to a few months ago, and those accounts still are not active. And those new players have you know, you know lost money on the video game because they spent money on the game micros the battle pass and so much more but activision and infinity ward hasn't said nothing about addressing that so that's really where i draw the line there and um also they haven't really addressed the recent splurge of hackers in warzone because hacking is so so easy in that game and i'll play maybe for about a couple hours and and i'm just done like i can't take the hacking anymore because i go for um like five games and in those five games Games, I'll make it to uh, towards the later end of the game and I just I get melted by some hacker who's aimbotting from across the map with the sniper or even before that in the game when I'm parachuting down below somebody just hits all of their bullets with the pistol and I'm sent to the gulag so it's really really frustrating to see that Infinity Ward has to address something that is so minor like that when there's something that's seen as the bigger picture with the hacking and the account being banned and, and again Infinity Ward has not addressed any of these things nor has Activision. Also to expand on the bigger picture I've seen numerous people still in, in the game with racist clan tags and Activision IDs again still in Call of Duty Modern Warfare like direct blatant obvious racial slurs but they want to go ahead and remove a symbol that everyone's initial reaction and meaning towards is it's it's a, it's an okay symbol and to me that's freaking ridiculous now, I think it was a great gesture for sure when Infinity Ward um, stood up for equality like they like they did last month with the Black Lives Matter post. But as a hardcore Call of Duty fan, guys, you got to address the bigger picture instead of just ignoring it. Removing an OK symbol should not have been one of the top priorities when there has been issues going on for weeks and months now. Um, and those have not been addressed or, or really had much done about them. And I'm talking about the hacking. I'm talking about the banned play and you're just now recently starting to address the racist clan tags emblems and Activision IDs um, and they're still again in the game but they want to go ahead and remove the okay symbol to me that's so so ridiculous um, but hopefully guys they do come out with a post um, within the next few weeks here talking about all of this stuff just to kind of give um, like an update with the fans um, I really do wish that they would be more talkative over on the Call of Duty Reddit I don't know why they haven't really communicated with us as much over on um, on Twitter or you know in, in live streams I really wish that they would do more live streams as well just to kind of create more interaction with the fan base um, 
but maybe all of that stuff is in the works for the next season for season five hopefully um and that's going to be coming out sometime in early august that's all i have to say guys those are my thoughts again leave me your thoughts down below in the comments thank you all so much for watching just really quick though again i'm going to be live streaming over on my twitch account uh, mr the reverts underscore and also on youtube as well um so make sure you turn on post notifications to be up to date with all that kind of stuff thank you all so much for watching love you guys so so much have a great rest of the day till next time i'll see you later